I put my 2k in extremely right position. And from here, of course, if you attack with normal Sotogari, you are actually exposing yourself for a counter of Sotogari. Uke is just stepping with his left, left leg behind and you are done. So, while I am forcing my Uke to go down, from this position, even if I attack and from this position, I make the first step. It's the step the same as it, it is for Ochigai. So, one, two. What makes, what, what, what makes this step uh, good is that I'm getting, I'm still above in a dominant position, but I'm getting closer to my opponent. And from this position, I'm stepping with my right hand slightly behind him, you see? And I'm forcing him to, to lose his balance, okay? So, here. I am already putting him down with my upper body, and now I go one, and then from here I have the same same movement as for Ochigari. I go behind, and then my leg can step forward, and he is really really losing his uh, position. Okay. So when I come to this position, and I'm here, the most important part is that my elbow goes up, and my also my wrist turns slightly like this. So his, his chin and his head will have to turn like this and he will come in this position. And it's really, really hard for him to keep the balance while, while he's like this. Either he's just waiting for, for to fall. So from this position, okay, now we are equal and I put myself above him. So one, up and throw. <laughs> up and get in the best position I can. Make a stand up and go. Okay. <laughs> Either you can also uh, make a combination with the inside inside hip. So up and one here. Up. Thank you.